Hey, hey, TikTok. Let's talk about snake plants. So here are some um, snake plants that I got from Doom Kitty, who is one of my longest and best supporters. Um, I've been kind of caring for these in a slightly abnormal way as I was busy until now. Um, but I kind of wanted to talk about the snake plant. A lot of people obviously like these um, and they're extremely low care and easy to grow. Now, you can oftentimes divide the root masses to spread them, but you can actually even easier um, take singular blades and cut these into three inch sections and stick them in dirt and basically water them weekly. And uh, that will also produce plants. Now here I was using three, two to three inch long strips of leaves. And you can see about every single one of them has sprouted new growth. Some are doing better than others. This takes a while. So there's a couple ways to do it. And if you want to maintain this larger look, you can uh, generally do so by dividing the larger plant into smaller sections like this. So now we're gonna get this planted and uh, get into it. So I've got six inch pots here and a nice bucket of dirt. I found that generally speaking, I get the best results with a slight increase in the perlite content for things like this. Um, you could also add sand, um, particularly if it was cacti you're working with, but I don't think that's gonna be necessary in this case because these are pretty hardy, easy to care for plants. Now this one's cut off and as I mentioned, you can propagate with blades um, of any length, but I'm gonna go for the larger look. So we're gonna stick this guy in this same pot and he will root over time as well. So once I've got these in the dirt and I've got that about halfway full, I'm just gonna scoop some more dirt in there to fill out the rest of the pot. And that's pretty much all there is to it. Now this plant is very hardy, so even if you kill off or damage the root systems, they'll be able to make new roots. So it's a really great beginner plant um, and it can really withstand long periods of drought well. So I highly recommend this if you're just getting into plants. Um, it's a great beginner plant. So I packed that in tightly around the base of this and once we're all done, we'll give these a nice thorough watering outside.